Hey, Lindsay, how'd you like to go buy some new clothes at the mall? Those old jeans are looking pretty ragged. Oh, thanks, Mom. I like my jeans. Dad's the one who could use some pants. <laughs> who am I trying to impress? When it's your house, you can wear a tuxedo to breakfast. I, uh, I called Mrs. Amendola. She's gonna stay with you kids while Daddy and I are in Chicago. Mom, no. I, we don't need a babysitter. I can take care of Sam. I can take care of myself. Oh, yeah. That's a great idea. I can just see you guys eating candy for breakfast and drawing pictures on the walls. How old do you think we are, Dad? I've been babysitting for the Kellers for two years already. Yeah, but that's for their kids. I don't know. Maybe they are a little old for a babysitter. Maybe they're ready, honey. Mm, fine. Mrs. M. Mendela makes the house smell like an old lady anyway. <laughs> I hear Peter Lemangella is playing the closing night gala. Paul Anka. Oh. Ooh, Paul Anka. Can I come? Yeah, I guess you'd prefer if we listen to that punk rock music I've been reading about. You know those Sex Pistols? They spit on their audience. Ah, oh, that's terrible. Yep, that's what I want to do. Spend my hard-earned money to be spit on. Now, that's entertainment. Oh, come on, Dad. Every generation is afraid of the music that comes from the next. Well, I'm sure your parents hated Elvis. Elvis didn't expectorate on his fans. No, but he died on the toilet. Well, that's paradise compared to where those sex pistols are going to end up. <laughs>